Yo 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 what is up guys it is man in Canada Super Piggy Man here today with another video and today we're gonna be playing some free man guerrilla warfare so to pretty much break it down this game is pretty much just like mountain blade warband but with guns it has all the same elements all the same tactics and stuff this game has gotten a major update since I last played it and um it's just uh it's gotten a huge like revamp like the graphics look great everything kind of really just looks great now so and they added more flags too of course we're gonna go with the flag that most represents us uh i don't know which one to choose uh which is the black one so we're gonna call our faction piggy empire all right and we're gonna click okay this is not gonna be our character by the way we are gonna be male and we're our name's gonna be general piggy general piggy that's gonna be our name so our hair color is going to be this color. Our hair is going to be pretty long. It's going to be brown. And let's go off. So this game really just is like Mountain Blade Warband. But it, like it has all the same elements pretty much. It's just it's more of a more of a shooter type of thing now. Now there are some things about this game that gets me pretty pissed. And one of the things is well here I'll show you. <coughs> um, so these are going to be all your attributes you know leadership obviously means you can lead more troops and everything like that intelligence um, helps you get better first aid medical looting that type of stuff uh, constitution or constitute yeah constitution is just uh, pretty much your health and then marksmanship is how accurate you are pretty much so we're going to put two three points into that and then two points into this and we are gonna put all our points into command which we can't do so we're gonna also put some points into inventory because that's needed and put two points into inventory so with that we'll put all our points into a rifle so sometimes the thing that kind of pisses me off is the weapon proficiency so this shows how I don't know if it's like a random thing in their game where it's like the likeliness that you'll hit a shot or something like that but it just sometimes it pisses me off because you'll have high marksmanship and you'll have high this and it just won't like the shots just won't hit so let's uh throw these pistol bullets in here throw the first aid kit and the two grenades too all right so we're off on our adventure to hopefully recruit some people because we need some people all right let's see uh marketplace or barracks i mean gss yeah you guys are too expensive too expensive too expensive too expensive so looks like we're gonna have to go out there and fight a bandit squad real quick shouldn't be that hard to find one around here so let's see so pretty much what we're gonna try to do in the first maybe three or four episodes is try to take zinc off so I will each episode will be I'll be recording for around an hour to an hour and a half and then I'll cut it down to about 20 to 25 minutes of gameplay and I'm doing this because I feel like you know I don't want you guys to watch like extensively long videos of me playing this and this is my first time actually doing a let's play let's play on a different game other than Kenshi so you know I am going to be explaining mostly everything so we're gonna go this way so this is what I mean by uh, it has well it doesn't have all the same elements but this is what makes it really fun you can actually control what your troops do so if I want them to go here you know go clear this position first and move up here and then move around here and then maneuver so he makes it all the way back around or oh, here back around through here I can but there's no point in doing that because I know how the game works for right now and maybe this is just all we need and we'll be able to pretty much uh, do this so there's some bugs like this bug right here where I have to go into my key mapping and it updates my game so it knows which keys pull out which weapons and what keys do what things so let's uh let's move with our group so let's go let's do this i'm ready but the game looks like 
aesthetically it looks pretty pleasing it reminds me of like uh, old Tom Clancy games like the old Tom Clancy games you know the Tom Clancy Ghost Recon if you guys had Xbox or anything I remember playing that game a lot it was really fun um let's see where are the enemy supposed to be oh see there's one enemy right there it will be really hard to land a pistol shot from this far but probably can all right so I'll try to work a flank or something you know something where I can get closer a little up and close with the pistol that hopefully won't result in me dying uh, there's a shot there's another shot I killed one got a hundred XP for that kill where are they at there's one Damn. it's gonna be really hard to do Didn't mean to shoot that person, but okay. So you have to be real careful not to get shot because the bullets actually do do a lot of damage. And right now I'm just trying to look for people. I don't know if they know my position yet because the CPUs are actually pretty freaking smart. And they'll know where you're at. Oh shit, they know where I'm at. But I don't know where they're at. Let me see right here. You guys want to back up towards this way? Oh shit, they're getting killed out there. My pistol proficiency is at level 3. Come on. Shots should land. Dude, this pistol does not have range. I'm just gonna keep throwing that out there. Pistol does not have range. Oh, I got him. He's still right there. Man, I do not have any troops left. This is no bueno. Up to 1v7 this. I need to get a clean shot on my guy. He's firing his gun at me. Maybe getting up on this hill would be a good vantage point. Oh man, this is a 1v7 against computers. Alright, well, I should be good back here. Uh, I don't know where that shot came from. Where did that shot come from? It's right there? No. Where are these guys at? It's gonna show me their locations in like 8 seconds right now. Sometimes this does happen where you don't know where they're at. Oh, they're all making their way towards me. All right, hold up. Oh, it's right there. There we go. Got one. Oh, 
Oh man, I'm gonna single-handedly take out all these freaking looters. Uh, so far away. That shot actually landed. The shots are actually landing. Oh, three of them landed, or two of them at least. Man, I wish I had long-range weapons. Oh shit! No! Crash. Man, this is a bad start. This is a bad start. At least we leveled up once. Increasing the shooting accuracy. I think I need that right now. Uh, 20 assignable points. Let's just keep pumping it into this because I know I'm going to need this in the near future. Oh, man. This is just bad. I got my asses handed to me right now. And I don't even have money. That's the thing. They took like all my money. Oh man. This is trash. Okay, so I need to find a way to have negative money. So it looks like after our first day, we uh, aren't that bad. Morale-wise, we're doing pretty shitty, but hey, can't do anything about that, huh? Look at that, morale's down again. Jesus, why is it so low? Reward troops. That reward really made them happy. I lost the money. Alright. So we're gonna head in this way. Man. Should we head to the lumber mill? Nah. Probably have some wax stuff. Oh, I was gonna go and finish up that freaking looter squad but you know what they got it what the fuck what happened to my party oh my god I only have two people with me now what the hell is that what the hell happened to my other two guys it's not cool Anyways, this iron mine always has gold in it. So this is something cool they added in. You can pretty much search the mines. Hopefully no bandits run up on me. Yeah, you search the mine pretty much and you could probably find some pretty cool shit that's worth a lot in there. And it's uh, not a bad find. It's not a bad find sometimes. But sometimes it could be a really bad find. Let's see what we got here. 
Ooh, that's not a bad find at all. That's actually pretty good money. We can probably get an actual squad now. It's a hard life for us right now. Hard life. Hard life, but difficult -er. Sexual life. Dun dun dun. Look at my guy. Think he pulls bitches like that? Oh, I'm just playing. Anyways, sell the gold, sell all this stuff. Even though it's not worth that much. There we go. And now, we can probably go to one of these villages that are out here somewhere. Uh, actually, we'll just go to this one over here. Those villages have some pretty good, like, mid tier troops sometimes. So it's not that bad to get them. just there we go man I hate being sick I hate having to stuff nose and making videos because I feel all you guys hear is this that's I feel like that's all you guys hear but I wouldn't know because who rewatches their own videos no, I'm just playing. anyways let's see what we got here light is it a light MLG? No. Alright. So I think I'll take the SMG squad. And let's see here. Party. Yeah, just combine them with the these guys over here. There we go. Disband this squad. And now we got some pretty happy peeps. So now we can go actually fight some people. Well, not that high tier, but you know, maybe so we can get those other guys too. That's what we need right now. Man, I should really turn off notifications like this. Like, what, like I don't know why it has notifications. <sighs> Human terrorist. Human terrorist. I might go to that other freaking mine that there is over here. Somewhere over here. It's like down here. That amber mine is actually not that bad of a pick. But it's not my thing to go to amber mines because amber mines don't have that much good things. Oh, look at that. 18 looters. Sometimes that thing lies and there's some armed marauders in there and sometimes it just gives you the biggest shit show of your life because you don't calculate that into the equation. Oh man, this is going to be risky but fuck it, we're born on risk aren't we? Ah shit, it's abandoned. Oh, Let's see how it goes. I really should. She says she don't know me anymore. Are they shooting at us from behind already? another one is that a dead body that might just be a dead body. Woo. He's 
trees up there on that mountain side. Where's this fool at? About to pistol him down. There we go. Oh shit. Man. Person in long range definitely has some shots. He's over there. They're both over there. This guy's in a hurry up. You're super itchy. Got him. Four kills. Nice. Take off. Imprison off. Right, there we go. So, let's see what we can get here. It's a Bieber squad stuff. So. Don't get me wrong, I don't have anything against Looter squads. It's just that. I don't know, it's more like just to increase your numbers type of thing, you know? It's not one of those, uh, oh, you know, they're pretty good troops. Ponza battalions are really good troops. I want to know where I can recruit those, because those are good troops. Those are really good troops, actually, not gonna lie. But that's personal opinion. I don't know if they actually are the best troops in the game. Sure. Um, okay. The conclusion I may be in. Man. It takes forever to search a freaking mine. Look at this. Whew. We got out of there just in time that 41 squad came. Oh man. We got so lucky with that. <laughs> 41 squad just came in and just like, oh man, just utter luck. Man, let's get a deal on that. Let's get all this fish. You guys might be wondering, hey, why are you gonna spend that money on fish? I need food, so. And we're gonna be growing our numbers too, so you know, we kinda do need the food either ways. So let's go and recruit some, and hopefully, we could get this video a wrap. So let's see here 12 bandits, a lot of looters. Hired. I 
I could go for elite machine gunners, but I feel like it's just too early right now. Too early to do that kind of upgrades right now. Let's try to get another squad here. Because that is what we do need. So let's see here. Looter squad. Fuck it, you're hired. We need more numbers. You guys will join this looter squad. Nice. Full looter squad now. Expand the squad. Yep. Now I can go fight some more bandits. Should be nice. So where are the bandits at? That's the real question. Where are they hiding at now? Man. Let's see here. So I wonder if you travel faster when you run along the road. I don't think you do. Not sure. Something good to look at. fight them. You know why? Because I'm a freaking badass. That's why. There we go. There we go. All you guys. Kill them. Let's go. Ow. I can't even peek out right now because that that just hurt a lot. That hurt a shit ton. I'm about to crawl around everywhere now. What's this guy doing? I should stay back. Clear waypoints. Alright. And these guys are not doing that good of a job. I am actually getting scared right now because they are not doing a good of a job. <coughs> Man. Let's look here. This is where three of them are. This is where two of them are. Oh no. There we go. Clear waypoints. Let's have you move back here. There you go. Let's focus our full attention to the front. There we go. Four of them are right in front of us, and we can't kill them. The last four are right in front of us. Kill them! This is also kind of annoying when they don't move, but I think that's because I proceed with caution on. Ah, oh, shit. The morale is low. Why are they backing up? There we go, charge in. They're still not moving. It takes like some time for these guys to move. I swear. Man. 
our Marauders are ruthless, man. Which is our. I wonder if they're gonna kill these two people. Like, you need the full combined strength of everybody to do it. And my militia keeps on getting killed. Yep, I was expecting for that to happen. And now we're in kind of a shit show. Because these freaking looters aren't moving up. They just charge. Looter was killed by armor otter. Armor otter was killed by militia rifleman. Look at that, now they're moving. There they go. Easy to charge in. Oh my god. A looter was killed. My freaking looters! There we go. This was a tough battle. This was a real tough battle, but you know what? We always need our tough battles to get our good ones. CG. Taking that. Black Fist, Force Combat, oh nice, some actual good things here, there we go, so let's go back over here, Stop expecting that to take such a toll on my army, but it's all good, so let's see what last minute moves we can make to seal off the end of the video. I'm gonna sell that. Sell this amber. Sell those cigarettes. This, this. Um, this. And just pretty much all of this. Alright, there we go. Get that deal. Get that sweet, nice deal. Bar. Army barracks. Nope. Too expensive. Nope, I know exactly what I'm getting if I buy you. Oh man. These guys are gonna have to join up over here. Oh, that's not good. These guys are all like perfectly fine for some reason, but. Let's see if we can make some last minute moves. So we're going to try to head over here to the other town, because I know this other town always has some pretty decent troops. So let's see if they do. If they don't, I'm going to be severely disappointed, because I thought they do. I wonder what that contraband is. Our marauders really do, they really are a challenge. But it is worth the money though. That is something that I can vouch for. It's worth the money. Rex, GSS, GSS. Do you have a 1500 one? He's allowed to go with this guy. See how much it gives us? Just two people, yeah. See, I knew what I was getting from that. Just add them to this squad, and that squad. Should be good. So, hopefully, you guys do enjoy this type of video. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and peace.